This is Beauregard Bugglesworth for station WBUG Bernheim. Welcome to our Bug of the Day interview with our motto, No Bug Too Small, We Love Them All. Our Bug of the Day today is Ms. Golden-Eyed Lacewing, who is with me right here, right now. Ms. Lacewing, welcome to the show. Thanks, Bo. Charmed to be here. Oh. Thank you so much. I'm glad you call me Bo. All my friends do. Well, tell me, you're a golden-eyed lacewing, and our viewers can see very easily why you're called that with your beautiful golden eyes. Would you show us your wings, too? Certainly, I'd be happy to. You can see why I'm called a lacewing, because my wings are as delicate as the finest lace. <laughs> oh, they certainly are. They're practically see-through. I love my wings. They're so different from those showy butterflies. Oh, yes, and they're a beautiful green color, too. Well, yes, they're green now, but in the fall, my wings will turn brown, and I'll crawl under some old leaves or behind a piece of bark, and I'll spend the winter there hibernating. But in the spring, I'll come back out, and my wings will turn green again. My favorite. Wow, that, that's just like trees. Oh, yes. I know. They all copy me. I'm sure I was the first one with that idea. Mm -hmm. our, our viewers would love to hear about your daily life. Just what do you do? Well, I come out at night when it's cooler. And that's probably why you don't see me as often. But if you look by your outdoor lights, you might just see me flitting around. I'm just naturally drawn to the spotlight, I guess. <laughs> oh, and, but then I will flit from flower to flower, sucking nectar and carrying pollen. I'm, I'm just as good a pollinator as those butterflies. I'm sure you are. Uh, our viewers would love to hear about your early life. Would you tell us about growing up, please? Certainly, Bo. I have come a long way. When I started out, I hatched from a little egg hanging from the underside of a leaf. And when I hatched, I was a little, I was a larva that looked like a little bug with big jaws and spikes all on my back. And I would crawl up to the leaf and I'd start hunting. I ate bugs. Ew. You ate bugs. Did you have a favorite bug? Well, I ate most soft-bodied bugs, but my favorites are aphids. I just love aphids. I would grab their little bodies and stab my mouth parts into their body like a straw, and my saliva turned their guts into juice, and then I would suck it out. Oh, it was delicious. That's disgusting. Oh, well, and then do you know what I would do with their little bodies once they were empty? What? I would stick them on my spikes all over my camouflage, and then my next victims wouldn't see me coming. You suck little bugs dry and then stuck their empty skins on your spikes? Oh, yes, I did. They wouldn't mess with me, I can tell you that. But you've given up hunting bugs now, right? Well, yes. When, but when flowers are scarce, I might still eat a, a bug once in a while. Just as a special treat. They're so juicy. Hmm. Wow. It sounds like you haven't quite given up eating bugs yet, right? Well, are you sure you're not a bug? No, no, I'm, I'm a human. You, you don't hurt people, do you? Oh, no, we help humans twice. When I'm a larva, I help eat all the aphids I can in the gardens to keep your gardens healthy. And then, as an adult, I help pollinate your garden so you can have lots of flowers and food. Um, you sure do look kind of soft and juicy. Are you sure you're not? Yikes! 
This is Beauregard Bugglesworth for station WBUG signing off right now.